Breaking news, Joe Ibukwe gets in trouble in APC after what he said as, um, you know, the party is ready to do what they call, you know, sanction him on, a, on account of what they call anti-party activities. We all know that um, APC set their interest nomination form at 100 million naira that has sparked up outrage, Nigerians asking. What do you need such an amount of money for? In fact, Falan has said he was going to take APC to court that that amount is outrageous, is anti-democratic, and if anyone who is young wants to go for such, what is the assurance that he'll be able to afford such? And so for that reason, you know, it's, it's not right. What people cannot afford is not right. In fact, you know, you mentioned countries in the world where people no longer pay for interest nomination form. You feel it online and you test your popularity if you'll be voted for. Only in Nigeria, you know, things like this are done. Let's get all the details. Joy Bukwe gets in trouble with APC after he said all these featherweight APC aspirants paying a hundred million for nomination form. What is it for? The money is outrageous. A few hours ago, the former spokesman and chieftain of the All Progressive Congress Party, Lagos Branch, Joey Bukwe, took to his official Facebook page to share a new post. He said, All fader with APC aspirants paying a hundred million for nomination form. What is it for? That money is outrageous. The special advisor to Governor Babajide Sanwolu who seemed to be strong supporter of Bola Tinubu political ambition, noted that he is wondering at all these lightweight members of the party who seem to be purchasing the 100 million Naira nomination as presidential aspirant seems to be doing. Furthermore, the guy said, who appears to be curious, However, ask if these aspirants preparing to contest with, their, with his boss are running out for minister, agencies, managing director position, or what exactly are they going for? Are they going for the same presidency Tunibu is going for? It may interest you to know that the reason why Joe Bukwe has, been, has felt the need to react this way he did was he believed that every other aspirant from the party family cannot stand up to the national leader as regards the office of the presidency. So therefore, he wants to believe that they may be buying the form for something else and not for the same pos presidential position. However, his words has gotten him into trouble as the a new APC chairman has declared that he will be dealt with with regards to him asking why APC has put their interest nomination form at the 100 million and why are paperweight politicians buying it. This is terms as an anti-party activity and Joe may have to pay dearly for the decision he has taken. So Joe may be getting more than he has bargained for. Mm, maybe getting more than he has bargained for as currently right now what we see is that um you know he called the party interest nomination form he said i mean he does not know what that money is for of course he was trying you, you can understand that he's trying to make a point here saying that um those who are also going for such a position do not really on that or know themselves that how dare they want to pick up the same form that tinubu has picked up and what have you that may be what he means however this is not getting he's not getting a free pass on this very thing he has said as the party is on him now to say you will have to pay because what you have said now sound more like you are against the party you are not for the party so you see uh, the words of joe joe continue to speak he continued to say things the way he wants to say them however in this case he has just used his own hands you know to shoot himself right on the foot Okay, he adjusted himself to shoot himself right on the foot. So these are some of the things happening. And sadly, um, you know, I don't know if Tinobu can save him from this. I don't know if Tinobu can save him from this. So these are, you know, matters that are ongoing. And um, we, we will watch and see as the matter unfold. Currently, uh, Joe, we all know that is a serious, uh, you know, is a serious APC man, a uh, staunch Tinubu follower that and um, nothing, you know, nothing will, you know,
Nothing will stop him, you know, from if he feels very strongly that, you know, Tinubu has got what it takes to lead the country. Of course, he's entitled to his opinion completely, totally, and nobody, you know, can take that from him. Just the way you, you among with all the, uh, the aspirants coming out, you know who you will want to vote for, who you think will do a better job than any other person. You have that person. Okay, you have that person, you know that person, and so this is what is happening right now. Uh, well, what we can see right now is that uh, there is serious call for concern, serious call for concern. As Joey Bukwe, you know, uh, he, he speaks, you know, as one who who uh, Tinubu has told that um, whatever happened, you will become maybe maybe a, a special assistant. Probably he's going to be taking over the space of, if, for instance, say Tinubu becomes Nigerian's president, he may be one of those who might be doing the job of either Garo Bashewu or Femi Adeshino, and so does not want to miss that opportunity for anything. Okay, so he has to stand through with the job, he has to do all he can to ensure that you know he gets you know that very position he's been envisaging for but rather really really sincerely speaking apart from him you know using his hand to shoot himself on his foot because of what he has said with regards to other aspirants and the way he loves tinubu joe really joe is a, is a serious somebody who you know if he if he believes in a candidate he follows through that's joe for you he believes tinubu is the man and come rain come shine Joe, that's Joe Bukwe for you. He will stand with the Tinubu's, uh, you know, the Tinubu cry will be. So every other aspirant who is picking up the ticket, he cannot understand why they are picking up the ticket. And you won't blame him. You know, just the way you believe in the aspirant you believe in is entitled to his opinion. Although in Nigerian government today, they are telling us that we are not entitled to opinion. You cannot say what you want to say. Mm -hmm. You know, you cannot do what you want to do because Buhari and the government say so. So Joe's words could actually be shooting him on his own foot by himself. So you see, so these are some of the things happening at some of the days upon us. Uh, we'll keep you up to speed more as the matter unfolds. Remember that everyone, we must condemn with strong term, you know, anything and everything that does not, you know, move us forward as a nation and as a people. So as a, at the end of the day, we are not, we are not disadvantaged. We must make that choice. It's going to be from one of the people who have nominated interest, whether we like it or not. If the election holds all things being equal, it's going to be from one of these persons. Okay. It's going to be from one of these persons. So it is what it is. Leave us a comment. God bless you. Bye for now.